Right, thank you everybody, thank you so much. Um, thank you Asanka for inviting us. Um, as we've heard now from the governor and from everybody else in the room, just in talking to each other, um, we are such a resilient nation, we are such a resilient people. There is, all of the fundamentals are in place for us to move forward. Right now, the order of the day is a, is a jump start. So the question was, as we look at what can we do immediately to help things forward, there were four challenges. I think we're all concerned that there is not enough meaningful support for the victims. And how we can participate in that is something that is core to the, pro uh, to the positive project. We've heard enough about the economy and enough about what needs to be done to put it on its feet. Um, and this particular project deals with that, and we'll get to the details of that later. I don't know that any of us need, you know, need to spend too much time understanding what our problems are. Cash flow, laying, laying off staff, these are all challenges for us today, and we need answers for that in the short term. So that, again, is what positive is about. For us, when we sat through, and as an agency, as we've been sitting with consumers, and these are consumers that, you know, at, at, the, at, the, at, the most, um, at the most vulnerable sort of places, when we go and sit and talk with them, the question is, and I, and I think what we found out in the whole process, was that there hasn't been a shepherding of the nation. You know, these horrible things that happened on the 21st of, of April left us by afternoon, it left us doubting neighbors, doubting friends, scared. The entire narrative was about who was at fault, who knew, what did they know, when did they know. Swords, sterilization, halal, storing each other. You know, the entire thing has spiraled into something that, that has kept us scared, it has kept us doubting, it has kept us frozen, it has kept us at home. So really the question was how do we build a narrative and a platform that allows a national healing process? Um, tomorrow will be two months since we lost um, Ramesh, since we lost Dulaj and Nuru and, and all of these wonderful souls. So for anybody that doesn't know, this project is by Tahira Rifat. She has begun the, the poignant and really you know, wonderful um, job of creating, creating these wonderful portraits and telling the stories of the people we lost. Uh, someone mentioned to me that as of today, we may not even know all of the names of all of the victims. So this was really important, and this was really core to the healing process. Um, so Tahira has come on board. She will help us with trail to be able to run the fundraising. We have also got tremendous support from other artists and other well-wishers to be able to build the fund up. And essentially, the hope is that we will end up with a fund of 10 million US dollars within the course of this 60-day project. Stimulating the domestic economy is key to this. This jumpstart is about being able to inject $500 million worth of spending in the domestic market within this short period of time. And we'll get, get into how in a minute. And of course, helping all of our businesses convert inventory into cash. And like I just said, we'll form through it a national healing process that is outside of religion, outside of politics, outside of all of the things that divide us. We create this platform that is neutral, that is positive, that is reinforcing, that really we are all Sri Lankans, we are all friends, and we are all, we're all on the island together. And we have to all move forward together and find a way, and find a way to do that quickly. So we are about positive people taking positive action to make a positive impact and create positive change in 60 days. That is core to this. This is a 60-day jumpstart project that helps us all back on our feet and moving quickly. So we're calling it the mega positive promo for the moment, unless some of our agency friends have a better phrase for this. And essentially, the call to action is this. 
we have a 60 day mega sale and it's been wonderful. I mean, we started this conversation, what, four or five weeks ago now, and it was a little huddle of people in a room. And now we've got 500 retailers on board. We've got various, we've got endorsements from the Retailers Association, from Tassel, from Slito, from Sri Lanka Tourism, from Love Sri Lanka, and it just keeps going. So the idea is we create a national sale across segments. This is across food, it's across fashion, um, white goods, uh, groceries, the whole works. So, and we understand that this sale goes right across the country and it is unified by the brand. It is unified, and, and I have examples of that coming up. It is unified by the tone of the message. So we know why we're shopping, we know what we're here for, and we know the purpose of the promotion. What is fascinating beyond that is that the rest of the structure is a collection and an invitation really to come on board and create your own events. Your independent events across the island and that could range from things like hot air balloon events to food festivals to fashion week and I know Ajay is on board. <laughs> this, uh, to various other things and right now creativity is what's going to run this 60 day program. It's going to be about how can we create experiences, how can we create ideas that are going to get people feeling confident, feeling secure, feeling like we need to get back together again and participate in this recovery. So essentially this is, this is the call to action. Join the sale, come up with all of the, um, all of the promotions and various other things, start creating the experiences. We'll get into some of the, the examples of that and then unify it all under one brand. So that there is, there is scale and there's visibility that lifts it higher than any one of us can do individually. To everything, and we've, you know, we've been tracking this for such a long time, the thing that holds us back sometimes, and I think the governor alluded to it, you know, what to do? You know, I'm just me. You know, somebody else is going to have to figure this out. What am I supposed to do by myself? I'm going to stay at home. And that is what holds us back sometimes. So we agree we need to unify. We need agree certainly that we need to do something. When it comes to what to do, this is what makes Positive Sri Lanka special. It actually gives people that thing to do. And that thing is not very difficult. It is about going back to our old lives. Buy that pair of shoes. Take your family to the cinema. Try that hot air balloon that you've always wanted to do with your family and not really got round to. Um, and with that, we get into the narrative that builds. And these, this is just an example of the language that will build around it. So these are, this is the kind of narrative sometimes, and it, and it, will, it will be up to us to understand how we infuse that narrative into our brands and into the, into the culture of what our individual brands are. But that is the whole tone of what Positive Sri Lanka is. It's about coming together to discover that you and your neighbor or that school friend of yours that you've, you know, you've got some differences with now, we can all reacquaint ourselves in, under the umbrella of this wonderful project. So when you infuse purpose with incentive, and you do it with everybody's help here, that is how we reach $500 million worth of spending in 60 days. I'm sorry, I don't know Tamil, but the, the point I'm trying to make here is that the essential conversation has been imagined across languages. And Sri Lanka grows when you buy positive. Sri Lanka wins when you support positive. Sri Lanka, um, you know, shaktiak venna ekatuan, ekatu venna. This entire narrative is what will glue this conversation together. It will glue the narrative together and make it loud enough for everybody to understand it and participate with it. Basically, um, in, in the last four weeks when we've been talking to people, we've, we've really been asking ourselves, how now that we have organized, how can we, in, how can we use positive in the future? And the fact is that you can. As we create it now for this 60-day uh, project, for this immediate purpose, positive can be shaped to fit any issue that we have. We can be positive for pride, we can be positive for dengue eradication, 
We can be positive for, um, you know, some floods that happen somewhere. We can be positive today. We can be positive next year. We can basically reinvent the platform any time that we need to organize for something. And that is really powerful. And that is something that we can keep using. Like it can be resurrected year on year. It can be shared, as you can see here, we've got a cross section of so many different industries represented and so many different sizes represented here. That is the power of positive. And it can change the course of lives. And that is why there is so much potential within this, um, within this platform. So to give you an example of how we are imagining this, um, you wake up on the 11th of July, and it's everywhere. It's everywhere that we would normally meet, um, you know, meet Heels at, at, or an Odell ad, or anything else that's out there. You know, something from Unilever, something from Hema, something from everywhere. We meet it in all our different touch points. See it on, our, on Facebook, we see it in the newspaper, we might see it on the street. And as it builds, say we're going to Kiel's, we see it inside. We wonder, okay, what is this? We're seeing it on, you know, on the Kiel's window, we're seeing it perhaps on the Cargill's window at, at all of the various supermarkets and um, stores around town. And as we see, we go into the store, its presence is really visible even inside. And you, you know, as, as people come in, they're really taken by what they're seeing. And they're, it's, it's out there in a way that you can engage with it. You have people tell you, people who work at the store tell you what positive is about and really give you the idea around what the movement is about. And as you purchase and as you get to the checkout, that's where you'll find our tills. And I'm sure we'll work with the uh, trail to understand where the rest of the tills and where the rest of the network gets into play. And as you've done that and you've bought whatever you want to get, then you receive some form of merchandise. And now th this is an idea. These are things that we've got to do. But it's about, you know, the little badge we're wearing today. It's about somebody getting something that says, I've participated in this. Something that says, I'm a part of a movement that is bigger than me right now. It's bigger than a 50% sale. It's bigger than, you know, 20% off something else. This is bigger than that because I'm doing it for a reason. Um, and then with that, we all start amplifying the effort. Um, we can do, I mean, we've just put up a few examples here, but we can basically create any type of merchandise and any type of, uh, of form of, of uh, say, a badge or some, something that includes us in the whole process. We'll see it on the news. Hopefully we've been having wonderful discussions with various media, and we're hoping that in the whole process we have the positive um, endorsements on va in various different ways across the channels. You have DJs talking about it, you have VJs talking about it, dedicating a minute or two of every session to tell people what positive is and why we should engage with it. That's the kind of festivity we're trying to, to master around the entire project. This is another example when, Ke when uh, Singer gets positive and how, how it might roll out. These are all examples, and it has to be said here that what we've created is an open source platform. So while you get, you can download all of the brand assets, you can also personalize them and customize them to suit your brand. So it's not, it's not a question of, not, of running some other piece of work, it's a question of understanding how the work integrates into your own branding so that it all comes together properly. Again, the same format. Someone will tell you about it. You will receive what you've got in, on your seats today. Um, you know, the information packets, uh, packets. This particular packet is about how you get involved and how you plan moving forward. But similarly, you keep, you keep getting reinforcements of how you participate, why you're participating, what this is after. And you create this festive air. So we've been talking to so many of you over the last weeks. Bars and restaurants can have special menus, promos, positive hours. We can all teach our kids how to surf in Arugam Bay this season because they're really going to need us all across there. It's about understanding what we do. It's about Elephant House potentially launching a positive variant or Cargill's or any one of them really. But it's about being able to reinvent it. It's about SEMA coming on board and giving us a discount on courses. And I know we've been talking about that. It's about free eye clinics. Maybe with so many of us not being able to get jobs at the moment, we learn how to become a fashion 
blogger or a fashion influencer, and that is how people like Odell and Fashion Bug and all of them can engage us. We need to demonstrate to our young people especially what potential there is in different spaces going forward. It's about discounts, it's about packaged and curated experiences across the island. Things that we can create, things that don't exist today, that we can create and create opportunities around. It's about fashion week, kite festivals, breakfast deals. It's, Nilushi, it's about dental camps. <laughs> Um, we've, we've always heard that scrunchies are Sri uh, Lankan girls' favorite accessory. Let's put together positive scrunchies that we can buy right across. You know? It's about a positive tea blend. It's about novel experiences. Sometimes it's just about butter, right? And how much you're going to pay for it. Uh, it's about handcraft. It's about, you know, trail, walking. It's about various things that get us together. It makes in a way that is constructive, that is positive, that is, that is able then to help all of us reacquaint ourselves with the normal life and move forward. We've had wonderful offers from various um, vendors already and various partners. Um, I want to say people like Dino and Block have already come on board and said that they will be positive partners. So it's about creating content that gets the virality that we need to get the project out there. Um, as we were, you know, as, as I was trying to eat my sandwich, um, a friend, um, Irfan, who is, who's, I think, still here, no, he's not, he came up to me and said, you know, please tell everybody that over the 60-day positive plan, for, especially for, for smaller businesses and anybody really, that they are able to offer us um, an e-commerce platform free of charge and delivery across the island free of charge. So imagine this, these are all, all the efforts that we're taking to jumpstart. It's about ideas right now. And it's about being generous with how we share the kind of ideas that we have to be able to move forward. There's been so much media support already. Thank you uh, to the Sunday morning for breaking this story. Um, but I think we've been talking to Maharajas also and various other um, um, other media houses about what we can do right now in addition to brands coming on board the media really have to get on board it's about free inventory it's about following the story it's about putting the right narrative into the story it's about amplifying the the experience you want to be in the shop talking to people as they're shopping together you want to be at an event talking to the kids, talking to families as they come out and support positive and rebuild together. It's about capturing that tone and making sure that everybody understands that we need to come together positively to move forward. Going back to the pamphlet on your chair, and the reverse, and I find, um, if nothing, Asanka is persistent like you have never imagined. Uh, he will hound you. <laughs> until we get this off the ground and it is a wonderful energy so right now on the on the back of it what you have is a step-by-step -step plan we're right at the beginning we're at step one the, the red tab that's where we are we've got to go back tomorrow get our teams together understand how we're going to participate understand what team is being put together to help take this forward um, from there, there is another deadline, which is about how to get back to us with the inventory that you're going to um, donate to the cause. There is no money being given to Positive right now for this, or at any point really, aside from the donation drive. What Positive is, is an open source free platform that relies on brands donating brand assets, meaning photography, meaning video, meaning all of that, because that lovely video that you saw up front needs to be produced with, with, uh, with more content from, you know, from, from other brands and various things so that we can put similar ones out there. We can build content using the content that you already have. You know, in a perfect world, we see the entire biscuit industry doing one commercial. Or you see promotions that actually demonstrate how the business world is, is embracing, um, embracing positive and, and working through our differences and all our rivalries. 
Um, so, in creative work with your agencies, it is really important that we understand that this is not while JWT and Group M and all of the other core vendors will be available for, for discussion on how to support um, the various campaigns that we're doing. Um, and that will come at no extra charge from us. Um, what's important to remember is that you engage your own agencies. Agencies that know your brand, work through your regular agencies to be able to capture the essence of positive in a way that is absolutely true to what your brand is and, and, and how your brand is moving forward. So it takes you right through the different steps um, up to the launch, which is scheduled for the 11th. Right, so with that, I'm closing now, but the whole momentum we have to build, the singer is positive, Abans is positive, Kiehl's is positive, we are all positive. You know, the whole idea is that we come on board in some way or form, we come on board across the different sectors, across the different sizes of business, um, as a business, as, a, as an employer, as individuals, um, so that together we are able to <coughs> deliver on 500 million dollars worth of domestic spending in 60 days. Thank you. Knowledge Box, the value-based media network.